Susan here. Welcome back to my channel. Today is Friday, September 6th, and I just got the most amazing thing in the mail. Yes. Uh, for those of you that don't know, uh, I am a huge Stephen King fan, and I normally don't pre-order books brand new, uh, but this time I did. <laughs> it's for his newest release, the book called the Institute and its release date is officially September 10th. Well, I pre-ordered through Amazon.ca way back when it was first announced and guess it came in the mail today. Yes. Okay. Had to show you, had to share this excitement with you. Oh my gosh. I, I don't do this. Okay. I just, I don't, I, I get books on bargain at Valley village and you know, that kind of thing. I borrow from the library. I never buy brand, brand new books. I, I get them for Christmas or for birthday presents. Um, my son is terrific for that. Uh, he'll say, you know, what Stephen King do you need next? And it's like, Oh, I need this one. Well, this one I did. Man, I am so thrilled. I actually have it in my hands. Here it is. Woohoo! Stephen King, the Institute. Yeah! It's probably backwards for you, but oh my god. Ah! New book. New book smell. Oh, yes. <laughs> this thing is, let's see. Uh, na, 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 na. 561 pages long okay and um, excellent excellent photo there's my boy Stephen King yes um, okay now I have a conundrum I am right uh, in the middle of reading book Five of the Dark Tower series, Wolves of the Kala. Uh, do I set that aside and and read this one? <laughs> what do you think? Should I should I continue on and finish the book I'm on, or do I dig into this one and take a break from the Dark Tower for <laughs> till I get this one done? Oh. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I I will ultimately decide. But I'm wondering, what do you guys think? What would you do if this was yours? Um, the cover is just amazing. The quality of the graphics are just, and it's like a velvety feel. It's all, it's a really wild cover. Um, the Institute. Okay, I'll read you the back cover because that's not a spoiler. That's a that's a tease. And um, if you don't know about Stephen King's writing, this might give you a little bit of an introduction to what his mind works like. Okay, um, the playground was surrounded by a chain link fence at least 10 feet high and Luke saw cameras peering down at two of the corners. They were dusty as if they hadn't been cleaned in a while. Beyond the fence, there was nothing but forest, mostly pines. Whatever the Institute was, it was in the middle of an old growth forest, which meant in the middle of nowhere. As for the playground itself, Luke's first thought was that if there were ever a prison exercise yard for kids between the age of 6 and 16, it would look exactly like this. The girl, Iris, saw them and waved. She double bounced on the trampoline. Shaw, what you, who you got there? This is Luke Ellis, Kalashaw said, new this morning. The Institute. Uh, it's, it's amazing. Um, the book price on the inside flap says US $30, Canada $39.99. I just paid with shipping. $19.69 for this uh, to my door through Amazon.ca and that was probably because I pre-ordered way back 
when the price was undecided and Amazon guarantees that you will get your book at the lowest price that it was put up for. So <laughs> I, I don't know. I never do this. I might be doing this. <laughs> uh, anyway, so thanks for sharing the excitement. I am so thrilled that this is in and uh, leave me a comment down below and, and let me know what you would do if this was your um, little puzzle. <laughs> you got a brand new book by your favorite author. You're reading a book currently by your favorite author and you're in the middle of it. What do you do? Um, I'm going to be asking my um, constant reader fan uh, page on Facebook as well what they're going to do with theirs if they're currently reading because they'll know what I'm talking about here. It's hard to decide. <laughs> uh, anyway, thanks again for watching and we'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.